current uh, view. So if you <laughs> click on your controller, there's a little um, on the on your right controller. You click the Oculus Home button. That'll take you out of spatial. There's a take photo option. You press that, and then it'll bring you back into the space and just oh yeah, face your face your uh, headset. Um, all right, I think we've uh, uh, have to adjust kind of our planning session a little bit. So why don't people shout out some of the reasons they love spatial, and then we'll go right into things that you would like us to see, and I'll just make some notes. Um, it looks like Peter wrote <laughs> Peter, Peter wrote easy to use. Um, any other things that you all are loving about spatial so far? What I like is the, the search option, and then it gives you a bunch of instant 3D models, but you're kind of limited to what those 3D models are. Mm -hmm. um, uh, if it, so when I'm talking about, um, you know, uh, I, mean, I know what the example is if you do parrot, it will come up with a parrot and you can use that, mm -hmm. but it's just that sometimes the, the search on it's a bit hit and miss or a bit limited. Yeah, but that just may be mm -hmm. the, the my inexperience in using it. Yeah, so um, when you do a search, uh, we are connected to Google, Google Poly, and so uh, whatever available images for that particular search will show up. So, so in some cases, there might be one or two, um, but dogs are very popular. So there's <laughs> lots yeah. of dog options, <laughs> as we saw today. So um, uh, as Google Poly's library improves, then there will be uh, more options. And in, in some cases, when you upload uh, or when you do a search, sometimes there won't uh, 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 a, a 3D model will not be included just because if it's not available. Um, yeah. All right. All right. Uh, any other things that you guys are loving and then uh, maybe like one or two more and then we'll jump on to things that you like to see. I think that's the more fun thing to kind of talk about, but it's always nice <laughs> to have a balance of both. Um, Aaron, I love the, uh, the desktop app. It's been so nice to be able to quickly type stickies and then throw them in the room as well as upload small 3D objects and set like uh, mm -hmm. we started using chairs and a conference table mm -hmm. so that when we're not in the same space and we have some AR, some VR, gives people a common anchor to kind of sit around and, and meet. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, the, do, do you search for like table and uh, or do you use yes. some of the preset <laughs> pairs? Okay, <laughs> excellent, excellent. Yeah, the, the, the 3D models like uh, we see right now have completely transformed the space. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite fun. We put the it's dog in fun. the Tyson's mouth. <laughs> That's great. Um, all right. <laughs> That's how few is useless. <laughs> Oh guys, we've got a. We need the Wait. curiosity rover so, in the sorry. dinosaur's mouth. Sorry, Peter. Well, yeah, you yeah. were saying something. I didn't quite catch you. Catch that. <laughs> mm hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, it was really nice, like uh, having Bree join in from the webcam. It instantly gave us like this connection to somebody else that's joining from the web app. Uh, and yes, sharing your screen is nice because then you you know you kind of avoid the upload option, and you can bring content in quickly into the room. All right, um, what are my some of the things that you're my all dinosaur is not responding anymore. <laughs> oh, I, I, I want to try and get the dinosaur to be this. eating the Mars rover because I think that's a cool photo. <laughs> <laughs> we will have to bring out the defibrillator for the dinosaur, so that would be interesting. Yeah, he's <laughs> so. he's he's choking he's choking on a hot dog. <laughs> right. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. And uh what are some of the things that you guys would like to see us do um or add new features that you'd like to see us add? Ooh. I mean, you can just shout them out. Uh, you don't have to create a note or anything. I, I think it'll just be too crazy, and I don't think we can move them around at this point. So, <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah we're not in the we're not in the store yet um but peter did you just have kind of this pixelation view on your quest is that what happened 
you guys, if that if that happens again, um, all you have to do is do a soft press on the power button and then soft press again or soft press it again. And then you'll immediately come back to the room and it'll remove that. It's a bug with Oculus that they know about. So um, I haven't seen it in a while. The, today was actually the first time I've seen it uh, maybe in a month or so. So um, this way you don't have to fully turn your device off next time. Um, that's kind of a quick workaround. Yeah, as a, you're like, what's going on? Is my device completely broken? No. Um. <laughs> Whoa! Someone took away the floor. Where's the floor gone? Yeah. Uh, so the reason we can't grab anything is because Mars is expanded so big, and now we're inside <laughs> a model, and we're kind of like all duck where we can't move anything so uh it's uh just just for that fact that uh, is what's what's actually happening at the, at this point so um we're <laughs> we're kind of all all limited in terms of moving objects at this point so uh so all right but you can um, you can still grab yeah. them you just we can't use the pointer is the main thing Yes, exactly. So you can teleport over to still, it. I can like still grab, grab the Curiosity Rover out of the dinosaur's mouth, and then I can put it back in. Yeah, yeah. You can have it. Exactly. So we're we're pushing the limits today. I love it. Um, any other oh, things that you, oh, that, you know, you all like to see, or or just questions in general? I mean, we can kind of transition this kind of. Talk whoa, whoa! It's so many Mars. <laughs> Oh, that's disorienting. All right. Whoa. Yeah, we got we got our lasers back. So here we go. Um, yeah, yeah there's a room other looks, questions cool in... now. So. Mm, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's just so true. It's pretty amazing. All right. Um, yeah, we're we're coming up on at uh, a little past nine. I, I didn't even realize what time it was. But do you all have any questions? And then we can kind of speak to the roadmap a little bit. Um, we we just turned yeah, into a very creative fun. Uh -huh. I don't. I have, be I have long distance. All day. Oops. All right. Uh, either one of you guys oh. who wants to go first. Uh... I I have one question. Okay. Easy. Short. How can I change my nickname? My name here. Uh, so if you go into the web app uh, in the top left, if you click on the menu and go to profile, you can just change your name there. Ah, oh, okay. No, not with the Oculus. I have to go to the computer. You, yeah, you do have to go to the desktop computer. You can do it from oh, your okay. phone too, you. Um, and just navigate there. And then I think you have to leave and come back for your name to change. It won't automatically update once you change it. We, we haven't synced it uh, up that way. Okay. Okay. Not with. Thank you. Yeah. Exactly. Um, um, this is the thing. So when Bree was saying that originally the, the, the concept of this platform is done in um, AR, um, and obviously with the, how cheap Oculus Quest are, is that going to be a consideration for the roadmap going forward? That will be a lot more features or abilities and things like that for, for Quest users, or is it still going to be more orientated towards augmented reality? Yeah, uh, that's a great question. Uh, you know, we originally started out as an AR company. Um, however, uh, you know, one of the most requested devices was the Quest. And when we uh, started supporting uh, the Oculus Quest, uh, the number of people and usage just skyrocketed. And mm -hmm. the Quest is our number one most used device. Uh, so mm -hmm. we are quickly iterating on this particular build. So there will be hand tracking um, and a variety of other things that will be coming to support um, the quest, including more VR environments, um, better drawing tools, whiteboarding. Um, and, and those are some of the things that are coming up on, on our roadmap. Uh, somebody asked me in our, the Slack community last night, uh, you know, what, what's, what's coming up and when. Um, I did post some information um, just brought more broadly about what, what's coming. Um, but we are spending a lot of time in development uh, in uh, on the quest at this point. So you should expect to see a, a lot more things uh, in in this device, uh, which which is super exciting. Good. 
And one of the things, just to say as well, what I liked about it was the the capability to live stream to YouTube because I was watching the um, the, the room design collaboration uh, that was on in, uh, a couple of nights ago. That's a great feature oh, yeah. that we mm -hmm. would be able to carry out a session, and then other people would be able to you know view that session from from YouTube. That's brilliant. Yeah, uh, and the because Facebook and Oculus are integrated. Uh, you can live stream directly to Facebook if you wanted to do that. So if you uh, really? okay, toggle cool. out, um, and I've tested it and it works, it works great. So a lot of our sessions okay. we we record and kind of share with the team. Does uh, this and work? Peter, I th I think captured a, a video of uh, one of our my demos yesterday. Uh, so it's, it, there are some. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that 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 was great. Right, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, all right, I just got a fantastic set of glasses. Check them out. Um, all right, well, um, you know, this has been this has been great. Um, very adventurous session, probably the most adventurous one I've had yet. <laughs> Thanks to our friend uh, at Disney here. <laughs> this was fantastic. I, I love it. Um, well, it's been a pleasure chatting with all of you. I know some people probably just dropped out just because we went over a little bit. Um, but uh, if you need to go, feel free to, to jump out. I don't want to kind of keep anybody, but I'm happy to answer it other questions um and hope, hopefully for any Ooh. of you that uh, need to jump off have a wonderful weekend and uh thanks peter for staying up so late uh hopefully that coffee kept you up <laughs> and then, yeah definitely it's great great to see you again you're welcome all thanks, right Aaron. bye bye yeah you're welcome jim <laughs>